It's stuck. Is this cringe? This is cringe. Oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna go get a flipping needle. This video is very inappropriate for minors. Um, please be 18 plus, 18 plus to do this. Um, I mean, I used to do this crazy stuff when I was like 14, 15, but we don't want to influence any of the younger generation. I'm putting this video to 18 plus because it's kind of like gory a little bit. It has a bit of blood, a bit of screaming. It was a fail. This is your disclaimer that if you don't like blood, if you don't like um, yelling and cringiness, do not watch this video. This isn't the video for you because I do this at home and I just want to put the disclaimer to not do this. Do not do this at all, okay? Disclaimer, do not pierce your nose at home. Hey besties, it's Becca. In today's video, we are doing something different, entertaining, and might be devastating. <laughs> we are piercing our own nose with an Amazon kit that I got off of Amazon for like 10 bucks. And there's three guns in it and it was super cheap. It comes with piercings and we're gonna do our nose like the other side and put a hoop in and we're also gonna do our cartilage. So it should be fun. So let's get right into the video right now. Okay, let me just say, I am super pumped for piercing my nose. Like I have been waiting for this day. Like, you know when you've been wanting something, but like you just forget about it. Like this is one of those things. Everyone has been like doing it nowadays. It's like the trending thing to have like two nose piercings. Like eventually I'll probably won't keep it in forever, but like this one I'm keeping in forever, but who knows? Just who knows? Also not promoting people to do this at home. Of course it's dangerous and I'm doing this for entertainment purposes and because I want to do it. And regardless of me filming it, I would be doing this like regardless. Like, you know, I, I just, I'm crazy, okay? And if anyone knows me in real life, they know that Becca's crazy. She will pierce her own tongue. Which I have two times. And I do, if I can do it at home, I will do it at home. Let's just say, I don't want to spend like $65 on a nose piercing when I can spend $10 and do it myself and take the 50 chance. You know what I mean? Take that 50 chance. I have had a ton of piercings in my lifetime of 27 years. <laughs> and I've had like two cartilages. I've had nose ring two times. This is my second time. I've had pier Monroe piercing two times. I've had my tongue pierced two times. Uh, one done professionally and one I did it, actually, I did it two times unprofessionally, my tongue. It didn't hurt that bad, I froze my tongue. My belly button done professionally, that was like the most painful um, piercing out of like all the piercings, believe it or not. I also have like my little earlobes pierced, but like they don't matter. <laughs> So we got alcohol. I just grabbed this from upstairs and put it in the bag because I didn't want to make like five trips. So we have like the hoop that we're gonna be using. Um, it came with like three studs and uh, I get all my piercings usually from like Ardeen's or like Claire's and, or Amazon. I brought some of these like in case we have to clean it. And then I also have like liquid eyeliner so I can like mark it so it's like perfectly straight because we don't want to have like a crooked nose ring. Just my luck, I would have that. But it came with this little bag. It has three guns in it, okay? And I was thinking like, when I like seen guns, like I was thinking about like the actual like little gun that they put through your nose, right? But these are like little, little ones, okay? I don't know how this is, I don't even know if you can reuse them, if you like sanitize them, like how, I. I don't know, I'm probably just gonna throw it out like one time use, right? Yeah. And it's steel, so. And it's uh, two millimeters, if you are wondering. It came with a bunch of like little piercings, so cute. It came with like all these hoops and it came with all these like little studs and more. I like L-shaped 
uh, studs usually in my nose or like the really swirly complicated ones because I swear they are so easy to rip out like you wash your face and like it gets caught on something and then you're like where I've lost two Swarovski ones already what a waste of money and I'm just taking like liquid eyeliner because I don't have like permanent markers and yeah we're using liquid okay so I am just going to like how am I going to even know this is like wow this is going to be hard guys this is literally going to be hard I'm a Virgo so it has to be perfect it has to be aligned the stars, the stars have, to have to line, line up. up it has to be perfect so um no i don't think that's perfect so we're gonna do this over again this is why you should go to professional okay because they don't take this much they don't take this long okay is that it I think that's where it should go is right there and I can't I can't tell if it's too high or if it's too whatever so I'm going to sanitize my nostril with some alcohol make sure you sanitize your piercing and alcohol and I am going to take the nose piercing you guys ready for this Hey guys, it's gonna go so fast. You're gonna be like, what? How did it just go that fast? Okay, so what do you do? You just, oh my God. I did that by accident. Oh my God, no. Okay, I fixed it. We put it back together. I was just trying to see like how it works, but um, it popped right open. So hopefully I, I got it. This is what it looks like. Make sure it's aligned up perfectly. But like, okay. My pits are sweating. You gotta go fast, right? Two, three. Go! Oh, such thick skin. Go one, two, three. It's not going through! Oh my god! <laughs> it's stuck. I'm pushing. Like, hello. Like, hello. <sighs> Should I freeze it a bit? <laughs> okay, I have a frozen water bottle. Oh no. <laughs> it's not sharp enough. The problem is nostrils are so thick. Oh! <laughs> oh! It didn't work. I'm gonna take these ear ones and I'm gonna try it with the ear one just to put a hole through. I'm going to freeze it. Oh, that feels real good. One, two, three. It won't go through. I'm gonna go get a flipping needle. I found this little small one. Hopefully we'll have to sanitize it. So let's sanitize it a bit. I need something inside, right? Yeah, because we don't wanna pierce our nose inside. Like we don't gonna get hurt. Okay, ready? I 
I heard it go through. I think. Is this cringe? This is cringe. Oh yeah, it's through. Okay, I think it's through. I need a rock star break. Wow. Oh my God, it is through. <laughs> it is through, okay. Um. Yeah, that was not sharp enough. I'm just gonna like move it around a bit. Okay. I mean, this is a really small needle and I want the hole to be a bit bigger. So we're gonna do this one more time. Do not do this at home. This is a no-no. Go to the professional. Okay, I know there's a hole there. Let's just try to stick a thing in. Oh my God, did I do it? No, hold on. It's in there, but I just gotta like feed it through. <laughs> okay, this is not working out. And I'm gonna jam it through that hole. Oh my gosh. This is a total fail. It's just not going through. Such hard piece of skin there. Like, why do they have to make it so thick of skin? Ah! Oh, it pierced my finger. <laughs> we got it. We got it through. It's through. It's through. It's Kurgan. I have to sneeze. Imagine if I didn't get this on record. It's too long of a needle. That's a really sharp needle. I can't leave that in there. That's like really sharp. I can feel it on the other side. Just let me get my bearings together. Okay, Karen? Okay, I know you were probably right, but you don't need to comment it. <laughs> you guys see it? Yeah, it's a real sharp one. Those kits are literally horrible. Do not buy them. I don't think it's straight, is it? <laughs> It's not straight, is it? It doesn't feel like it's aligned. <laughs> so does my brain, it's not aligned. <laughs> but now that we have like a hole, how am I gonna get this out? It has like a weird end on it. Get out now! <laughs> That's what the end looks like. It's like a, it's like a spiky. And now we should take the hoop and see if the hoop will fit because I cannot leave that thing in. That is like way, way, like way. And then we're gonna take the hoop. I know hoops are fine to pierce for, for like at first because they asked me if I wanted a hoop for my nose ring. Oh my God, that was easy. You just like slid through. 
Wow, we did it. But my nose is swelling. Wow, yeah, that was horrible. That was literally horrible. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put a disclaimer in this video that if you're freaked out by blood or screaming, um, not to watch this video. Cause we'll, won't this come out? That way if I had a ball, I'm gonna go look for a ball one or maybe I have a ball one here. I have I do it comes with a bunch of ball ones okay because I'm just nervous I'm just nervous that like it'll come undone won't it I like I like this gold one do I have a gold hoop in there okay I gotta rip this I gotta rip this apart. Where's the end? <gasps> I can't find the end. <gasps> oh, this is a bigger one, it feels like. Okay, we got it. Oh my god, this isn't even a. That's it. This isn't even a proper one. It doesn't have like the thing on it. Oh my god, okay, I have to go get it. It's upstairs. I have this brand new kit and it has all these little jewels on it. Super cute. And it has the ball one, okay? This is the ball one we need. So, so this is the ball one. We're just gonna, ooh, she's tender. She's tender. Oh, found it. <laughs> found the hole. <laughs> That's what he said. So you see the ball, that, oh, yeah, it has the clip in then. So you clip that in that hole. There's like a little hole at the end of the ball. And that way, if it spins, it doesn't come undone. I couldn't fit the actual bar in the little ball thing because it actually can like snap together, but it won't snap because I think it's a broken ball. I don't know. Um, but yeah, this is what I had envisioned with having my nose done, but I don't think, I think it's crooked. I think it's like too far down a bit, but I mean, is someone coming up to my face and saying, oh my gosh, your nose ring is a bit further down. Like, you know what I mean? I'm not gonna do my cartilage because I do not trust those piercing guns, okay? They are awful and um, yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what happened. Please give it a thumbs up and like, subscribe because we post content all the time and we're crazy on here. And um, give this video please a thumbs up because I went through so much flipping pain. Literally cringe-worthy, fail-worthy, um, everything. I hope to see you guys in my next freaking video. Bye guys.